Good morning, peeps. What's going on? Just waking up. It's uh, it's not stupid early. It's about 7:30. Um, back at it again here. We're at the clinic, and we're gonna see how it goes today. Uh, we're doing. Uh, well, I'm not doing nothing. I'm just, I'm moral support because of COVID. I can't even go up with her, but she's going up for ultrasound. No blood work today, I don't think. Yeah. Oh, blood work today. Oh, there she is. Look how pretty she is. I love her. Look at her little llama mask. Mm -hmm. Now, when I say this girl loves llamas, mm -hmm. I'm going to get you a shot of her bathroom. There's <laughs> like glowing llamas in there now. But anyway, so what, do you, what are we doing today, honey? Blood work ultrasound. Oh, oh, add, added bonus. Sleeping Beauty in the back seat. Look at that, eh? That's cool, eh? All right. Anyways, there you go. <laughs> <laughs> Blood work ultrasound. Blood work. Good ultrasound again see if the follicles grew and we're hoping that they grew and we're hoping we're hoping for good stuff today good news we're we're optimistic today i'm optimistic wifey's getting a little discouraged but that's okay it comes it comes with the with the you know with the whole scenario it, it just it is what it is so yeah I mean, it's a nice day, though. It's not too cold. Are you kidding? It's freezing. I oh, see. Wah. No. <laughs> I'm tired of winter. I love the cold. I mean, I mean, that's just me, though. You don't really, you're not really cold buff. No. But, uh, yeah, so that's where we're at today. <clears throat> so, I'm going to leave you with that. And I promise we'll get you a shot when she uh, comes out of here out of the appointment and we'll let you know well she back <laughs> the sun's in her face how did it go baby no growth no growth oh she, she can't see hang on a sec peeps so where do we go from here she said more than likely a cancelled cycle again Okay, so are we gonna are we gonna do the shots then? She mentioned them. <clears throat> How do you feel about but that? She has to talk to the doctor first. Oh, is that what she's doing? Well, they're checking the blood work first. I'm gonna check the blood work. See where it's at. Oh, I can't see anything. Yeah, it's so bright. I'm gonna. Morning guys, so it's just me here today um, going for another ultrasound and blood work um, to see if my follicles have grown. This is kind of like the last probably appointment. Um, if they haven't grown, this cycle will be cancelled. Um, <clears throat> um, Chris isn't here with me, unfortunately, but I have to work right after this. I've been super lucky that all of my appointments haven't interfered with my work schedule, um, so that's been good. Um, but yeah, we're doing pretty good. I've come to terms that this cycle probably will be cancelled, um, but I'm hopeful for um, for the next one. Hopefully they'll introduce um, something stronger that I will respond to. Um, the hardest part will be waiting. I'll have to wait until day 35 of my cycle before I email them back because they want to try and see if it'll come on its own. Um, side note, there, it's freezing cold outside and there's people running. I don't know. I could not do that. The wind is brutal. Um, sorry if you can hear the heat in the car, but it's really cold. Also, another side note, do you like my llama mask? Isn't it so cute? I've been searching for one of these for so long, and I had to order one on Amazon because I couldn't find it. Um, but also, I'm drinking decaf. Um, the caffeine withdrawals are real. It was terrible for a few days. I had a headache and my body hurt. Um, it was bad. But I'm now on decaf because... I needed something. 
And honestly, like, I missed my morning coffees with everybody, you know? It was, like, boring. I didn't get one. Um, so I figured, I know decaf coffee still has a little bit of caffeine in it, but we'll get there. Um, so yeah, that's what I'm doing. I'm just waiting for my phone call. And, uh, just wanted to say thank you for everybody that's come along and been there and sent us encouraging little notes and um, it's been super helpful and I hope that this uh, this helps someone um, like I said my my biggest thing was I was so scared because I didn't know what was gonna happen I didn't know the process I didn't know um, what I was expected to do or not do um, so again if this is your you're just starting your journey um then I hope this eases your mind a little bit um but yeah so I will see you guys after my appointment hey guys so finished with my appointment um it's looking like it's gonna be a canceled cycle there's still no growth um I'm currently day 16 um the nurse said best case scenario would be to cancel this cycle um and then just restart um she did give me an idea of what the next cycle may look like of course they have to pass it by the doctor uh, make sure he's okay with it but um it's looking like i'll do letrozole day three to seven of my cycle instead of day five to nine um and then my second visit um it would be uh, an injection to try and help my body do what it's supposed to do on its own um, so yeah we'll see what happens I'm just waiting on an email now um, they'll email me by like two o'clock um, these people are like really on the ball <laughs> so um, yeah we'll see what the email says if my estrogen increased then the doctor is still gonna push to see if I do have growth like I'm on day 16 so I should have growth by now um, but if my estrogen is increasing which it has been just at a very slow rate um, so they're thinking that's mostly what my problem is um, is my estrogen is not increasing um, like it should be but so if it's still increasing and the doctor is still hopeful then I'm still gonna go for more blood work and ultrasounds um, and yeah so we'll see what happens um with my blood work results and uh yeah i'll let you guys know what's going on peeps how's everyone doing uh just wanted to cap off this this weekend for fertility here uh, we got our email from fertility and uh they haven't completely ruled out the cycle yet. Um, she's going tomorrow. Should be able to go with her tomorrow. I missed out on the last one. Um, anyways, um, she's going for uh, blood work, and they're gonna let her know they might do this shot that will help the medication work. But. Um, we just wanted to have some closure on this this week. Um, I'm still optimistic. I'm feeling it. Um, I, we really thank you guys for watching and and your comments really help. Um, you know, little little notes of encouragement and stuff, and uh, it's it. It really helps, you know. Just little things. You got, you got, you got to enjoy the little things in life. But yeah, so we'll be back at you in the next video with uh, next week, this week. Keep you posted. Thanks for coming along.